Damn it, I just got comfy. Where's that bloody flashlight? <sighs> this job's supposed to take me through to retirement. Not give me a heart attack with their stupid Halloween pranks. Hello, base. Walk to the watchman here. I'm outside. Oh, lousy Japanese rubbish. What the... Oh, it's one of those cardboard cutout thingies. <laughs> Try to frighten me, eh? Mancunian, are you sure you tied those bad guys up nice and tight? Yes. It, it might be a while before the police get to them. The gang is tied up tight. I mean, after all the trouble we went to capture them. I've been doing this for several years and never lost one yet. Okay, if you're sure. I am. Okay then. Impact, do you want to go back and check on them? Nah, I'm just messing about. You use double and triple knots on them. They're not going anywhere. No. <sighs> Are you sure this is where you park the car? You're doing it again, aren't you? Yeah. Well, stop it. Maybe. We did well tonight, didn't we? There are two thugs tied up on that roof who know we did. We'll take the long way back and see if anyone else needs our help. The police alert. We need it elsewhere. Just point me at the bad guys, Mancunian. How did you end up being their go-to guy for weird crimes? Let's say I prove my value to them. I could get results no one else could. You sound like washing powder. So where are we going? Salford University. I'm thinking of applying to do a science degree there next year. Did you go to university? Yes. Which one? University of Life, where I graduated top of my class. Even at this speed, this is going to be a long drive. I could have you for assault.
I was just saying hello. You know I don't like you costume types at the best of times. And this is one of those times when I like you lot the least. Just as cheerful as ever, Inspector Grey. Another circus freak. Shouldn't you be at home watching Hollyoaks or something? Really? That's what you think teenage girls do? The normal ones. Normal? Normal? Listen here, you big southern Jesse. Easy, Impact. We're here to catch crooks, not reopen the north-south divide. Inspector Gray, I was told to meet you here. Perhaps we can start again? Shall we be talking about the dead man? She really has it in for costume types. Was she like that in London as well? I think she's mellowed a bit. She doesn't like me. She distrusts the special relationship I have with the police department. Damn right I do, Sonny Jim. I know all about your so-called special relationship. And if I have anything to do with it, the relationship will stop. If you want to fight crime, join the police. Well, Inspector, for the moment I have the full confidence of the police commissioner, the board of trustees... Yes, the yes, local... get on with it. I'm sure the world loves you, but I don't. Well, go on. Do whatever you do with your special superhero powers. We don't have special powers. We're just very good at what we do. There's been a murder. Let's concentrate on that. Sliced and diced. I really don't like her. That's odd. Look at the edge of the wounds, Mancunia. Flecks of paint. <coughs> Inspector Gray? Well, it's about time. No, we'll view it in the watchman's office. Follow me. We have the CCTV tapes. I'll set the tape up for you, Inspector. Funny how we keep calling it a tape, isn't it? I mean, it's all digital ones and zeros now. Be that... quiet. You're babbling like an idiot. Yes, ma'am. It's my nerves, you see. When's this, and where? Five minutes before the attack. The corridor leading to the hall where we found the dead watchman. 